Shadow of Homosexuals. <laughs> it's your boy, the Shadow Boxer. It's Monday morning, 8 a.m. I'm up a half an hour. Had a good sleep, nice sleep. Well needed sleep. Look, I'm patching up again for fuck's sake. Awful rumours going on around about me. Awful rumours. <laughs> We've got Jack at 11 a.m. Told you, wouldn't let you down, would I? I was, I was gonna put my off another day and I said, fuck's sake, man. Why? I had to do some things. But come here, come here, come here. Coffee, coffee. I'll see you there, uh, 11 a.m. Powerhouse, yeah? Monday. Get out of bed, the fuck. Homie sexuals. See you soon. Ready, engine. That Apollo won't know what hit him. You're gonna roll over him like a My name is the Shadow Boxer. The greatest fighter of all time. I've come here from a different planet to save you from the evil. The evil that is fake fighters, fake fights, fake money. Shadow boxers here for real fights. So put down your boxing gloves. Put down your bullshit. Can I say bullshit on the intro? Put down everything. Cause the boxers here to stay. My name is Shadow Boxer Alex. Let's go, bitch. It's a little warm, is it, lizard? It's a little warm you have. Because you get a nice view of the beach too. I met I met Louis here. Louis, we didn't even get into nationality, but I'm saying Canadian. 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 Of course, you took it out of me. Of course, <laughs> the Great White North, baby. <laughs> Met this guy on the little my little walk trail. Uh, great guy. I can see me and Louie hanging out in the future. He was talking Definitely. about. He was talking about ice baths. He was. Little did he know. <laughs> what I had in store. <laughs> I have a two barrel ice bath ready today because I never did one. So Louie, on you get. Huh? The Canadians are used to the cold. Yeah, I know, but this is uh, taking it to another <laughs> level. But I'm up to the challenge here. Let's uh, let's give it a go. Let's go. All right, just jump right in, eh? Jump right in. You've seen how I did it. Sit back, get your head under. Um, this is two days worth of ice now, viewers, so um, know that this is a tough one. So what's a good... Uh, a minute is a good one. A, a minute. A minute is a good one. A minute is a good one. G-Sync, wasn't it? One minute 55. Here we go. That's your two, get out of it. Canadian Louis. You're fucking super here. Come out to the, come out to the, the sunshine here. Get a bit fucking. Right, we have another customer. David from France, my neighbor. Good guy. He is um, a very, um, he, he's into all this sort of stuff. <laughs> I'm constantly seeing him across the radio with handstands for three hours a day. Here we go. Relax. Oh, it's not that bad. Not, Not that bad. bad, he says. Beautiful. He's okay. <laughs> Let me put the thing on for him. I'll give you the best one. I'm listening to, I do it by songs. I have songs on the radio, right? Yeah. Fucking Brian Adams. I oh, forgot what song boy. it is, Canadian. right? But his song, I think it might be everything I do, whatever it is. The song finishes after three minutes and, I, and then I'm allowed to get out of the ice yeah. bath. Yeah. Is it two minutes yet? No. So the song finished at three minutes, but then it's an encore! The encore baby. So I had my heart set and getting out. I had to wait for the encore for another three minutes. I was fucked. Maybe died. <laughs> David's right, David, problem. you're at about one minute twenty. Are you serious? I'm guessing, because the screen's on black. <laughs> give it I'll give it thirty more seconds, yeah. He's you're talking when you're talking same as training if you're able to talk to the trainer while training that means you can do more so i learned a trick now as they say nothing <laughs> <laughs> i just look like i'm fucked and then he lets me stop he's over two minutes now yeah for sure yes tomorrow don't bring the glasses so you can dip your head that's the nice shot there look at the work look at the lines yeah wow look at that that's cold, baby. Everything's popping out, David. Yeah. Popping, baby. Oh, your abs are but popping straight out. Straight on the stage here now, David. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'm the fighter. I swear. <laughs> He's nimble. <laughs> yeah, How was that, David? Tell the viewers. Tell the great. viewers. Is it the real deal? It's oh, yeah, the real deal. You'll be up for this every morning. We're going to get a team of us doing this every morning. 
Yeah, lads. I'm up for it. I'm totally up for it. It's good, man. I was doing my yoga, you know, getting yeah. sweaty and warm, you know. Yeah, You're fucking right. <laughs> Right, that's the shot there, lads. Is this colder than the one you've done before, yeah? Yeah, because... You mean head under, right? Yeah. Sit down, put your head under, just for a second, and then sit back. Okay? You're on. I have a recording. <laughs> that was proper. <laughs> Proper initiation, how to start it. Yeah. <laughs> we got our boy Jacob up. If you do Jacob's from Germany, he's a good guy, he's looked after me since I got here. And he and he's been asking me all week for the ice baths. Head under Jacob, head under. Head under Jacob. <laughs> Get under! No, today is just a, a, a lean in. Head under? I did. Two times, start and finish. I'll tell you how many seconds you're on, all right? How many? You're on 20. The boys have done two, the boys have done two minutes, Jacob. Make you do it Yeah. Don't okay. talk to me, just keep going. That's the fucking shot. That's the fucking shot. 40 seconds. Fuck, it's some body on this, lads. Australian surfer. <laughs> Right, we have another man, round two, David. Okay. Let's get in here. I will place the head in, okay? Uh, Lou, can you make video? And send I'm to coming, hold on. Pull, pull, pull it. Who the fuck the dog? <laughs> the dog's in next. <laughs> okay, hold on. Wait, wait. The dog doesn't know what we're right, fucking hold. up the lads. Okay, I'm gonna video you, David, hold on. Done. I think go my for it. Well done. Well done. Yeah, mine was my Fucking my beauty. Nah, no balls. Come here, lads. Well done. Hey, so everyone good for that. 9 a.m. every single day, yeah? 9 a.m. What Sounds about you, good. Pat? Pat, you in? No. No. Do it. Do it, of course. Just do it. I we have to be need to do it. Ah, yeah. oh, that's good, man. Ken. Oh. Never, say, never say you're not able to do something. Exactly. Shadow boxers, talk to you soon. A little bit late, it's 20 to 11, start at 11. I haven't eaten yet, I have to eat a little something, but today maybe me and Jack will just uh, just, just get to know each other, do a small bit. I uh, have to get somebody to eat and go training. But good morning, great start. Oh, we've got adventures now. I'm going to start hiking with Louis every morning and we're going to start ice bathing, an ice bath club, four members. Come on, join us, let's do it. Sorry, Cap. Oh, shit. 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 What the fuck? What can I eat? It's not the healthiest breakfast in the world. But it's good. Carbs. Carbs. Um. Carbs, protein, a little something. I had a long morning of ice baths, not eating. It is what it is. A bit late. Talk to Trump. The look at Powerhouse. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Powerhouse. 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 This is made for me. This is just about. You, 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 you got to be a half an hour early to any training session, especially an old man like me. Need to warm up. I'll talk to Jack today about just going easy on me and we'll see how it goes. Happy to be here. I'd say the viewers are think they're dreaming. The shadow boxers training. <laughs> I'm not training, yeah. I, got, I could run off in the next few minutes. Let's get in and see what's up. I think Jack is training a guy, so I'll have a little look. Remember, we're in June right now. This is June. Jacko, busy man, busy man. Top trainer, actually. Top trainer. First way in. Hundred, hundred and one kilograms. 
that could be my walk around weight because I never seem to be any other weight. <laughs> right, I'm gonna warm up. Back. My back is very weak from, do you know what it is? Lying on the fucking bed all day long. I start using the couch. That's my back gets out of shape on my knee as well. Yeah, I've always tried to like kick off with you, so I'm like, like you backed the wrong horse, boys. <laughs> you backed the wrong fucking horse. Yes, everyone else falls. It's the only way we're going to win this Grand National. I'm only joking. We have the Lord on our side. You, you met Jack at the fence the last day. He's a good guy. We, we fell out of touch for a month, Jack. You, did. you didn't call me back. That's what happened. <laughs> I said I wanted to come. He never texted me. So we're here now. He just finished his, his first session in the morning. And he not, we, we know what the understanding is Jack knows Mike as well. Dude. Bit of an asshole. Understatement. <laughs> <laughs> Understatement. We won't get into it. We're not here, the, the bitch and drama, even though that's what you're going to get. But Jack's going to get me ready for this boxing fight in a couple of weeks. And um, no better man to do it. Yeah, um, I'm feeling good. Obviously, down the line, our whole, our whole focus is to get me to an MMA fight because that's what the people want to see. Re real fucking fighting, my toy. That's too real for me. Non-stop, <laughs> non-stop kicks and legs. But give us a bit of background, Jack. You're from England, obviously. Yep. Whereabouts in England? Uh, I'm from Chichester, so between Portsmouth and Brighton on the southeast coast. Right, right, right. Something to do with football there, maybe Portsmouth. Yeah, <laughs> That's yeah, most yeah. Irish people are going to pick up on the football. Yeah, so between Port Port near Portsmouth. Okay, and you've been doing Muay Thai at home in England, obviously, to start. I started fighting MMA, so my first. Yeah. So I first started martial arts. I fought MMA. I had five fights in England. Yeah. Uh, but then, in order to work on the striking, I started coming here and then ended yeah. up with Thailand and then. Had a back injury out here, really bad back injury, so it stopped me grappling, stopped me doing MMA. So now I'm just focusing on Muay Thai and being a trainer. Okay, and th this is, by, by the way, viewers, this is your spot, Jack. This is, my this is his, this man, it must be, what, 25, Jack? <laughs> he looks good for whatever age, what are you, 30, 31. Eh? 31, there you are, right? And so he's younger than me, but he looks 10 times better. But um, Jack owns this spot. I think it's the best looking place in Phuket. I've been around. Powerhouse seems like my future home. We're gonna do a bit of training. There'll be no more shy talk. This is Jack, this is my coach. And let's see us at the top, world champions. Right, Jack, let's get to it. Get it. Touch yourself. Right, coach. One day we don't push her, push her. You've got a big project, big project on your hands. What do you think? I mean, it's potential. You now we're not starting from scratch, so that's the main thing. You don't have too many bad habits, so it's great. So that's also great. I just think that focus a little bit on footwork, so that everything's below you at all times when you're striking. You give you the most power and effectiveness with your shots. So a good space. Good, good, good base from the waist up. You know, the punches are nice. You, you, I don't have to correct too much technique. We just need to bring the lower part of your body into uh, maximize power. Okay. Thanks. Go back today. All right, okay. Jack Powerhouse. Check him out. Mm. Touch yourself. 
Check out, it's wonderful stuff. Hello team. Did you like that, did you? Was that fun? I have to talk now why I feel like this. After I do a heavy training session in anything in life, that is when I'm at my, you're meant to feel good after exercise. I, my brain is weak after exercise. The doubt just fucking creeps in because today is another step back on the game. I'll tell you some, some shit is after happening there. I'm just, the, the doubt creeps in. I'll be thinking like, can I fucking fight? Hey, what are you doing? I'm thinking, did I say anything stupid to fucking me coach? Does he think I'm a fucking idiot? All this stupid fucking anxiety. All these fighters you see in the UFC, they're just fair play. Obviously, some have no personality, but they're confident as fuck. Are they fucking thick? Are they dumb? Am I too intelligent? Is that why I fucking worry? I don't fucking know. But I will say this. We're after getting some news now. There's a fucking promoter in Phuket. There's fuck all going on. I've heard about this fucking fight. Now, I'm not saying it's stamped. They want to do their own fucking videotape and they want to take this fight and bring it on to a promotion. Fucking hell, they've heard about this. It's not stamped, but it's more or less done deal. Darren talks with Mick, I don't have to deal with Mick anymore. Mick's gonna get fucking paid by someone else. It's a real fucking fight now. I'm weak as water. I have to fucking figure something out here. I'll talk to you soon. Hey, show's gone well so far today, huh? Oh, fucking goody for you. All right, subscribe there, will you, these cunts? Like as well.